I love Kansas State football. I graduated from K-State. I was a walk-on in the basketball program, but it's the football program that I've always had a deep passion about because of Bill Snyder. One thing Coach Snyder used to do that I love was have his teams enter and exit the stadium, whether it's pregame, halftime, or at the end of the game, together as a family, as a group, because there's strength in numbers. You can apply that same strength in numbers, that same family type of approach that Bill Snyder's football teams took to your job market approach. I'm John Chalesnik. In this edition of Q&A with STAA, Coach Bill Snyder's example will help you find sports broadcasting opportunities. I want to address the referral request email. The gist of it is that it welcomes or gives the opportunity to people you already know to help you in the job market. So the first step in the referral request email is to reach out to somebody that you already know in the sports broadcasting industry. Ask them some advice about how to handle your job market approach. And then at the end of the phone call, ask if they can refer you to two or three other people with whom you can have a similar conversation. Then when you contact those people, you say, oh, our mutual friend Joe Smith suggested I contact you. I'm in the job market. Joe thought you would have some great advice. These people that you don't know, the referrals, are much more likely to help you because you come referred by somebody that they know and they want to help that person if they don't know you. But the other reason is you're not asking these people for a job. You're simply asking for their advice about a job and you're flattering them by saying that I believe you have wisdom that can help me in the job market. Usually by the end of your third referral request call, somebody's going to tell you where there's a job opening. Remember the key though, at the end of each call, ask the person you're talking to if they can refer you to two or three other people with whom you can have a similar conversation. In our next edition of Q&A with STAA, I'll share a three-step plan for moving to the next level of your sports broadcasting career. If you want help networking for job opportunities or help in moving your own sports casting career to the next level, we'd love to work with you. Join STAA, just click on the link in the description below. And if you have a question or a topic you would like addressed in an upcoming edition of Q&A with STAA, email it to us, QA at stawatalent.com.